Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we're just gonna continue the previous video. Um, this is also gonna be an introduction, but this is solely um, an introduction to the actual lessons. So today um, we're gonna go more in detail about the course, as well as some of the things that you need to know before you start the course. So let's get started. So one of the things that I wanted to briefly discuss, um, I know we discussed this in the first video we did, I think, or maybe it was in the description, I'm not sure, but what is Amharic? So, Amharic is one of the official languages in Ethiopia. It's an Afro-Asiatic um, language, so it's... Um, Another language that would be in this category would be like uh, Tigrinya or um, languages in that area. Uh, the Maharic language is written um, in a modified uh, form of the is alphabet. So there is um, 33 primary characters. We went over this in the alphabets video, but I just want to go over it. And each um, primary character. Um, has seven forms including itself so the six forms will be for the vowels and then the first letter we'll go over it a little bit when we do the review on the alphabets but um i did a video on this so if you're a little confused on this you should go back and watch that video so um you should do some prep um for the course because the course is going to assume that you have some knowledge on the Amharic language. So before you begin the new lessons, you should complete a few things. Um, so watch all the videos, um, the video lessons from the old class, uh, practice the vocab words on Quizlet. Quizlet is such a powerful tool. Um, you can quiz yourself, play games. And it's just so powerful and I would really really recommend that you practice some of the vocab words on there. Uh, as I mentioned the new lesson, the new class will move in a way that assumes that the student has some prior knowledge on the Amharic language. So I'm going to assume that you have some knowledge on the basics of the language when I'm teaching that class. So it's very helpful to watch the previous video so you know some vocab words and, and you have some knowledge on the language. Um, I want you to um, utilize the blog because I do um, tend to go deeper on the less, um, you know, deeper on the explanations on the blog because I do have more time and I can write more. Um, I want to keep my videos shorter so I tend to sometimes um, not properly explain things um, which um, which I'm trying to improve on. I'm gonna do better when it comes um, to the upcoming videos. I will go over some basic concepts in this video that will act as a foundation for you when you start the class. So any videos that I'm going to mention in this video are going to be linked in the description as well as in the class um, during the chapter um, chapter 1 introduction section of the lesson. If I'm going to talk about a document specifically, I will link my blog and you can go over there and download the assignment. So, the one of the things that I want you to really um, focus on is the alphabets. Um, I did a video on it, it's going to be linked in the description. Um, make sure you go over the different letters and how to pronounce each letter. This would be seriously beneficial when you were um, learning the, um, when you're doing the classes and the classwork because some of the words are going to be written in Amharic. So, if you have some idea of what what the sounds are it will be really helpful when you're doing the assignments of course i will go in detail in the videos and in the lessons but it's great to have some prior knowledge on the app so in this section we'll just go over some of the basic uh, definitions for the parts of speech i will not read the definitions you can read them on the screen however um, you would need to know what a noun is um, of course, the Amharic word for noun is sim, s, m, s, m. So the Amharic word for noun is sim. Um, if you go, um, if you go watch uh, the 
greetings video. Um, sim can also mean name. Um, let's see. Um, we also need to know what a paragraph is. Of course, I'm sure everyone, uh, everyone who's watching this video knows these basic definitions, but I want to give you the Amharic word for them so that when I mention this word, you know, okay, she's talking about nouns. Um, the Amharic word for paragraph is ankats a n k s. Again, it's a n k s. Ankats. Um, we also need to know what a sentence is. Um, the Amharic word for a sentence is Araf Tanagar. Araf Tanagar. Again, Araf Tanagar. Araf Tanagar. Verbs. So the Amharic word for verb is guess. Um, guess. Um, you also need to know what a word is. The Amharic word for word is kal, ka, le, ka, le, kal. Period. Um, I went over uh, the punctuation signs and what they're called in the alphabets video as well, but we'll go over it um, in this video. So a period is a ra, na, tip, a ra, t, na, tip, a ra, t, na, tip, a ra, t, na, tip. Question mark is t ya ki me likit. 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 Exclamation mark kala gano. Ka le a gano. Ka le a gano. Kala gano. Comma is not a last sentence. Ne te la se re se. Ne te la se re se. Ne te la se re se. Um, you can learn, like I mentioned, you can learn more about punctuations, what they look like, and things like that in the Amharic video. Amharic alphabet video, excuse me. The link will be in the description. Um, I have a list of must-watch videos. If if you can't watch the whole series, I know it's a long one, it's 22 videos, you should really, really watch these few um, videos that I listed on this screen. So the Amharic Alphabets, as I mentioned previously, that video has um, the Amharic Alphabets and Punctuation because I felt like those go together. Um, you also need to know the days of the week and numbers in Amharic. That is one video. Um, the month in Amharic, description words in Amharic, nouns in Amharic, pronouns in Amharic, prepositions in Amharic. So that's um, seven videos that I really, really recommend that you watch and review before you get started on the lessons um, in my new course. I will have a link to my new course in the description. And you can get started on some of the resources that I posted in the introduction section. So the introduction section will have some resources, the alphabet chart. It will have the pronouns chart that I, um, that I showed you in the pronouns video. But I have a PDF version of it that you can reference when you're doing the lessons. Um, these are the two resources that I posted currently. Um, I'll also have this video on there, um, which you can watch any uh, anytime anywhere um so that will be the introduction to the course section that section will, will have a mini quiz but it will not have a grade requirement so you won't have to get an 80 percent in order to progress um to the next um chapter however the next chapters that are coming will have a grade requirement you must get an 80 percent on the chapter quiz in order to progress this is just so that i can see that you're actually learning the things that i'm talking about instead of just breathing past the lessons um thank you so much for watching if you have any questions make sure to ask me in the comments below um i read all the comments um I, I i might not respond to all of them but i do like them and give them a heart because i really do appreciate all my viewers um so thank you so much uh, for watching if you like this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up um those thumbs up motivate me um if you also 
enjoyed this video make sure to subscribe it's free i hope everyone has a wonderful day and again thank you so much for watching bye